adult comedy tour. My adult comedy tour. Mature audience only. We'll call this How to know when your girlfriend finally uh, trusts you. How you don't want a girl finally trusts you or makes you think that she trusts you. I've been watching uh, some Bill Bird lately. And uh, I think when you're finally uh, seeing each other butt naked, I think there's uh, some trust right there. I'm trying to go with the uh, figure out my uh, my delivery here. I think we see trying to spit out the same uh, info that some other comedians do. But when I see um, all these fucking cucks around me, cucks, cuckolds, guys um, trying to impress all these bitches with uh, fancy dinner and uh, literally not speaking their mind playing the uh, playing the game playing the uh, yeah playing the game that uh, let me uh, shut up and uh, press the right buttons do the right moves so that uh, I can drop the panties and that's when she's uh, finally let her guard down And there are exceptions to the rules. There are uh, women out there that uh, will let you think that uh, you dropping their panties that, uh, that you guys are cool. And uh, that's not true because um, there's some women out there that want you to um, drop their panties and uh, so they call rape or get pregnant by you to uh, take it to family court and uh, get that. Um, payment from you, especially the famous guys, especially the famous guys. And that's where, um, that's where dating is today in the year 2016. And, and I wonder, you know, I, and I wonder, I wonder about this a lot because, uh, me, I'm not, uh, I'm not married as I age like wine and women age like milk. That's a Tom Likas reference. And no, um, I don't uh, hate women. I don't. I, I love them. I love women. I, um, um, I love uh, cuddling with them, tickling them, uh, kissing them, kissing every millimeter of their body. Massaging them, just um, smelling their their skin on their neck. Um, <clears throat> and uh, just the uh, physical pleasures with them. They're, uh, they have had some memorable ones. So no, I'm not uh, some asshole that hates women. But I also... Um, don't believe that I should uh, give a woman, promise a woman, a woman happiness, when in actuality all, all I can give her, really offer is, uh, are unique times, unique times, um, memorable moments, some funny moments, um, probably, probably offer more adventure than happiness. <coughs> 
And uh, if you know me personally, you'll know where I like to hang out at. How far, uh, far I will travel. Um, the people that I associate with. Yeah, motherfuckers that uh, shit. They just don't, uh, well, they have a reputation. Where was it? When do women trust you finally? Or, uh, the last question could be, um, when did we finally, when did, when do women finally believe um, that the guy could be trusted? You know, when we've seen each other butt naked. But when some people say we've seen, seen someone um, asshole naked, like that's, sounds funny to me because asshole naked, of course it's asshole naked because they're fucking naked. It's like saying, um, back of the knee, show me naked. <laughs> Makes no fucking sense. <clears throat> but, um, what the fuck was I at? Yeah, being single in the year 2000, being single, sounds like a bad word. Sounds like a lonely word, actually. In a sense, in a sense, there is some some loneliness there because um, I know that there are some amazing women that are are laughing at this, a couple that will laugh about this because they're like uh, because they behave good and they're they're not uh, twerking, they're not um, creating this uh, propaganda online of a, a perfect uh, Facebook life with uh, a thousand selfies of uh, of them being flawless. You know, not ha <laughs> not having any uh, self-esteem issues, not uh, not worrying about uh, the, the balance in the begging account, not worried about the uh, tab on the credit card bills. Party, party, party. Right. <clears throat> um, I saw uh, yesterday with the story with uh, DJ Academics that um, some thought that hole over there, some Instagram model, Instagram model. Got uh, around seven million dollars from game from the game, the rapper, for touching her inappropriately. Fuck. Well, it sounds like a bitch for me to say this, but um, she deserves that money for um, shit for game dropping his fucking card down. Dropping your fucking guard down, dog. You know, you know that if you're a celebrity, you're an athlete, you're a fucking someone with <clears throat> money and fame. You need to keep these bitches minimum one arm's distance. I think that should I ever reach that level, I think um, you will find plenty of uh, sex tapes for me. You will. And I will actually probably leak on myself or make sure that they get leaked because I would never want uh, some woman to ever come back and say, oh, he made me do this and do that by force. No, you're going to be a dirty little whore. You're going to tell me in your own words what turns you on, what doesn't turn you on. And, and uh, we'll go from there. Because although game just lost a lot of money, 
there's some boys out there that uh, lose uh, their life, their career, their reputation, other stuff like that. And uh, that's it for now because the battery's dying on this phone.